I don't know what to say. I mean, wow. So then you approve? More than approve. I just want to know why. Why, why did it take you so long to tell me, Diana? I mean, oh, oh, I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you because I knew how you felt about Cassie. Who's Cassie? Oh, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. We're done. Finished. Oh, sorry. I'm not. So you're not mad at me then for not telling you? Let's see. Mad would not be the word that I'm looking Good. for. Good. Driving me crazy. Oh, saucy. What about protection? You're my protection. You have no idea how much I need you right now. You were behind this whole thing, Annie. Just like you were behind the plane crash and the kidnapping. But you're not going to get away with this. You're not. Because I'm going to find you and I'm going to take you straight to jail. Straight to hell. I'm like a cat that you can't kill because I've got nine lives and you're going to lose, psycho lady. Just find the ring. Find the ring and figure out that I'm here and take me home. I want to go home. Must have been a broken shoulder or something. Mm. Been a long time, huh? A very long time. I remember when we used to go up there. We used to imagine a world where we could be together. We used to pretend we were the only two people on Earth. Remember? And for a while we were. But now we're not. Look, I just think that you're trying too hard. You know, we both need some time to just readjust. We can't expect to get it all back in one night. Look, you're right. I'm sorry. I told you I wasn't going to push, and I'm not going to. It's 
this is very hard. Because I love you so much. Jesse, stop, please. Look, You're want, taking this all the wrong way. I want things to work, Michelle. You know what I want? What? I want what we had on that bed. I want the love and the warmth we had. The promise of a beautiful life together. You see it? See what? That's where we married ourselves. I want what we had when we said those vows to each other and to love each other forever. I will always love you, Jesse. And it was beautiful. It was. I took you as my wife, and you took me as your husband. We said our vows to each other in front of God because we said he was the only one that mattered. You remember? Yes, yes, yes. But don't you see? I mean, this marriage thing, it was an adolescent romantic fantasy. Trying to elope, reciting those vows, I mean, it wasn't real. It was real to me. God meant every word when we said those vows to each other. Jesse, I'm just trying to tell you how I'm feeling. And I get it. <laughs> all right? No, Jesse, you don't. No, you're not getting it. You don't get it at all. You know when you were blind, you didn't want me to find out because you thought I'd feel sorry for you? I had the deepest respect for you. Now I feel sorry for you. Jesse, wait. Jesse! Jesse! I can see that now. Why did you think Joshua was coming? He doesn't even know you're alive. Don't be so sure about that. Joshua and I have a special connection. We always have. And if he even senses what you're doing, he thinks you're dead. You think you're so smart because you got your hands free. Wait a minute. Now I get it. Get what? Joshua said you'd never take your ring off. And it couldn't have been so loose that it just slipped off your finger. Or you would have lost it before now. Oh, my ring. My wedding ring's gone. What do you take me for, a blank page? You know it's gone because you took it off on purpose, didn't you? No, of course not. Yes, you did. You were trying to trick me. Well, let me tell you something, little Miss Tulsa. That was a big mistake. Tell me it's not true. I mean, tell me you didn't sleep with Dinah. Hey, Cassie. You want the truth? The truth is, I don't remember what happened that night. But you were with her. Yeah. I went over to her house, okay? But, but like I said, I don't remember what happened. I was drunk. That's no excuse. But I'll tell you something I do remember, sweetheart. I remember what you told me on the terrace. You told me that you didn't love me. You told me you never loved me. You're saying it's my fault? That I made you run straight to Dinah? No. No, I'm not blaming you at all. I, I take full responsibility for my actions, but I wasn't in my right mind. No. You weren't in your clothes, either. You know, I was angry. And I was hurt. And I was confused. And I was a lot of other things, too. And I couldn't understand why you would lie to me, Cassie. Yeah. Why you would look me in the eyes and tell me when, that you never loved me when, in fact, I know you did. Well, if you didn't believe a word that I said, then why'd you go straight to Dinah? Maybe I was looking for some kind of solace, okay? I don't know. Maybe I already did something that I regret. But let me tell you one thing. Whatever happened there, it wasn't making love, Cassie. It wasn't lovemaking. Mm, that was great, baby. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was exactly what I needed. Me too. I just wish we didn't take so long to do it, you know? Yeah, well, you know, they say timing is everything. And ours was. Perfect. You know what I think I'm gonna do? I'm gonna call that guy in Chicago. I'm gonna tell him I'm not gonna make it right now. Why? What do you mean, why, baby? So we'll get somebody else, you know? I mean, come on, Dinah. I'll stay right here with you. That way we can make love all day and all night. No. No.